negative matrix. As you can see, the example on the board, so we have a matrix, okay, so there are six elements in three by two matrix, we just times by negative. Okay, so it's, yeah, it, it, it is kind of scalar multiple of a matrix, okay, to a matrix over here. So if you have negative matrix of this matrix, it's just multiplied by mul you know, times negative to everywhere, everywhere, okay? So this, this is a negative matrix of this matrix. Easy? Okay. We'll do some, uh, take some examples over here, see how you can have a better understanding. So here, so we have two matrices given. So we're going to perform the operation. It's negative A minus B. Okay, negative A minus B. It's, it's, it's like negative A, negative A. It's, it's okay. Okay, no, no matter what you think, it's completely okay. Now, negative A, negative B, okay, it's not negative A times negative B. It is negative A minus matrix B. So, so just be careful, it's not times between them. So negative A minus B matrix is here. So first of all, so you have to work on, say, negative A. So what's the first element of matrix A, which is 1? So we put negative in front of it. And what's the first element of matrix B, which is here? Can you see that? So that's 1. So we made it as negative. So it will be negative 2. Okay, at the end of the process. So okay, we jump on to uh, we jump on to second part. Okay, so the the first column, first row, the first row and first column, we move the uh, the first column, second row. Okay, so first row and the second column. Okay, now what is this one? What do you think about here? So you have here, say zero, negative zero, and then negative b, which is here negative four. So that's how you do. Okay, I'll leave you to fill here. Okay, can you guys try? Say negative one and negative one here. So we have negative, negative here. Okay, so what do you think? Yeah, positive one, positive one. Easy peasy. What else? So we have two and two. So which is negative two and negative two. So that's the kind of working, okay, kind of operation. And the next step is to write your answer. So how do you write the answer? Make a preparation of write your matrix form over here, okay? So write it like this. So all you need to do is just calculate. Say so evaluate. Negative one minus one is simply over here. Negative two. Negative zero minus four is where? Negative four. What else? 1 plus 1 is simply 2. Negative 2 minus 2 is just negative 4. Do you understand that? So that's basically the operation of uh, this kind of algebra, algebra of matrix by the use of negative matrix. Okay? Okay. We will take another example which, tell, which, which tells us bit more complicated situation of the negative matrix over here, okay? So look at question two over there. So we have a two matrices are given, and then we want to find another matrix, which is called X, if three matrices are in this kind of relations together, okay? So your first step is to make X its own, okay? So like, like an algebra, like a, uh, like a basic algebra or basic linear equation to solve what x is. So we'll do exactly the same processes. So your first step is to move a to another side, okay? So move a to here will, will result negative a. Subtract it. Okay, what else? We'll take negative out, make it positive, okay? And change all the signs over here on the right hand side. What do you want to do? Divide both sides by two. As you can see, it's not different at all. Okay, it is completely identical to the basic algebra. Okay, so the skills of matrix is now starting from this point. 
So what are you going to do? So we, that is x, and that's how you produce x. That's kind of recipe, okay, of the meal. So what are you going to do now? Write your matrix over here. So write half, write half over here. So that will be the answer, okay, to the question, okay? Find x over here. So what are you going to do? So we have b, okay? So negative 3 times b everywhere. So over here, so negative times by negative 3, times by negative 3, times by negative 3, times by negative 3. And then plus a. So, so for example, the first one, so we have negative 3 times 1 plus 1. Where, did you, where do you get it? Which is here, which is from there. So that is completely coming from this algebra, okay? So this expression. So we just move on to the second element over there, okay? Which is the uh, first row at the second column. What do you want to do? So negative 3 times b plus a. So write it. Negative 3 times, okay, 4 plus 0, which is a at, the, at this location for this element. Similarly, we do, we do work for this and this one, okay? We'll come out like this. And the last one, negative 3 times 6 plus 2. Just write it over. Too easy, guys, okay? So next step is to write your final answer. So write your uh, form of the matrix so before you do anything here. Say, what is it? Negative 3 times 1 plus 1, negative 2. Neg sorry, negative 3 times 4 plus 0, which is negative 12 over here. And then what else? Negative 3 times negative 5 plus, sorry, minus 1 is 14. And then negative 16. You get it, guys. Okay? So, next step is to divide all of the elements by 2, as instructed over here. So, what are you going to do? Divide 2 by 2, which is negative 1. Divide 12 by 2 over here, which is 6. What else? Okay, 7. And then 8. That's everything. So, in taking this opportunity, so matrix is basically following most of the algebraic skills and algebraic rules, such as, say, uh, we, we just want to make live as matrix matrices, then you are quite able to solve the matrix itself as part of the linear algebra like this one. It's no trouble at all. After that, then we have to follow our own rule of matrices operations. Okay, so I, I hope uh, this doesn't cause any trouble for you. Okay, we'll see you at the next lesson.